gentlemen, this is Battlegrounds. Can we make some noise? Yeah. Yeah. We're at the Moonshine Club in South Sea, and we're about to get into the first battle of today. It's been popping off for a little bit, bit of back and forward. It's even a little bit more awkward when they're on stage performing <laughs> with one another. But we move, we move. This battle is sponsored by Hubbly Bubbly, so make sure you check them out. Thank you, a massive love to them for sorting us out and everyone with the prizes. Anyway, battle to my left. Can we make some noise for Peach Keys? <laughs> We're on the same team. <laughs> and battle to my right, you know the sound, it's Tommy Brown. <laughs> We flipped off camera, Peach has opted to go first. First round on Peach. Can I remind everyone to uh, be fucking quiet? And uh, whenever you're ready, Peach. If you're at the last one, you'll like the start of this one. Now let me set the energy in the room. It's true my ex fucked me like she was a dude. She'd pull out the strap on and whack on some lube, but then shit was easy like battling you. So loosen up, bro. Stop acting such a big man. You're a teacher at a school in Pompey, but you act like you've got big plans. Your features make your views go down. Maybe you should ditch Dan, because having him mix all your tunes, honestly, just a shit plan. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There's no heart in your bars and no brain in your heads. You're famous in Pompey, a city that's famously dead. <laughs> you should get off this island. There's a whole world to see, but you're stuck in a classroom marking GCSEs. <laughs> like, how could I not beat you in a battle? when you look like you've come from selling meat at a raffle. <laughs> and I bet the only reason you teach is to tackle that unresolved trauma of getting bullied and hassled. Time. Time. Woo! Woo! Right. What a way to start off. First round on Tommy Brown. Let's hear it. Open your mouth. Got new meaning when this guy came first. His neck veins burst from saying lame words like geez, but this geez let him take turns. <laughs> no homophobe, the only phobia I got is running out of eye drops to combat the effect of getting high to escape this guy's vibe. <laughs> Stop time to evaluate this reprobate. I'll go toe to toe with a broken float. Even word of mouth know the bloke's a joke. Devote two seconds of screen time. I rewind to find a sign of superiority. Find instead dwindling quality of a wriggling wannabe dropping period on me. Stop, please. Ooh. Properly gassed up geese. Lap up these bars as I wrap up this tart. <laughs> Apple pie crumble. I'm humble when you cry. Start to like your fashion <laughs> sense and then I nut and see some sense. <laughs> <laughs> Passion fruit porn star martini in pink dungarees, hence I think he's experienced with more than one disease. <laughs> Time. Let's make some noise for that round. Alright, we definitely got a battle on our hands. Fuck it, Elf. <laughs> Alright, Peach Skis, let's hear it. Second round. You're like Mike Skinner from the streets. If the street was Albert Rhodes. <laughs> You're in three separate groups or bands that no one fucking knows. <laughs> you, spend your, you spend your days writing lines for kids, because that's the life you chose. But see him on the weekend, those lines go up his fucking nose. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, mate. Oh, come on, come on. You got it, Pete. Go on, bro. Oh, yeah. Right. Got it, got it. <laughs> See, Tommy Brown's a teacher, so it's safe to assume he was bullied at school. And his solution to that problem was, I'll teach maths, because that's fucking cool. <laughs> yeah, I'll recite pi to a million digits, inspire the lives of these silly little midgets. Then I'll write bars like, I'm colder than frigids, and freeze on stage like a bitch who is frigid. Oh. Bad timing, because of what <laughs> <laughs> Frigid. I'll freeze on stage like a bitch who is frigid. I will, apparently. Because that's all you are, Mr. Brown. A bitch. You're like Walter White, but you're just cooking up shit. Headshot part two. It was stupid and dumb. Especially because no one asked for headshot part one. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Let's make some noise Ah, right. It's why you don't write bars the day before. <laughs> Round two on Tommy Brown. This lad's done. <laughs> I've had enough. 
I fucked your mum and my balls you fluffed. <laughs> Rough around the edges, yes, but I say it with my chest. You are what you eat, testicle. <laughs> This is a test. When you walked in like a punchline today, you had horrible fucking breath and your lunch in your smile. I could smell you from a mile. <laughs> and while we're on the subject, let me elaborate. Look at his front tooth. It looks like I kicked it using kung fu. <laughs> <laughs> Dumb you. <laughs> is that time there? You want to go it? Yeah, we'll call it. <laughs> Uh, uh. Final round on peach skis. Let's go. You're the worst rapper I've ever heard. And I know MC Dan. Say <laughs> 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 again. You're the worst rapper I've ever heard. And I know MC Dan. I bet at home your kitchen's filled with licked out bags and empty cans. Nitty slags and dished out grams. Trusted with kids? Nah, that's part of the plan. You give them an A and they'll give you a hand. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, mate, I fluffed it. If I can give you an A and they'll give you a hand. Ah, you're so young but look so old. <laughs> it's like you've, you spent too long in the dryer. Fuck. Oh, mate. You're so young but look so old. It's like you've just come out the dryer. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, mate. Call it, call it, yeah. All right, let's make some noise. Final oh, round on Tommy Brown. Let's go. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> You're as dry as Gandhi's flip flop. <laughs> <laughs> you won't last just like TikTok. Oh. I'll show you who's boss, Rick Ross. <laughs> Hip hop reaction videos. I'll react to the act of you swinging your dick like an axe at a carnivore. Claiming you're for the easing of suffering of animals, you fucking cannibal. <laughs> Eating the flesh of God's green plants, you can't <laughs> top these bars, you've got soggy farts. <laughs> Plus you hit it raw. <laughs> is the locked jaw because you're on MDMA? Or is it related to why your bum's sore? AIDS. <laughs> At the end of the day, no beef with me, mate. You can slip right through the door. Slender bender voting Brexit. Veg in a blender, slowy sexton. <laughs> Sniffed the rock atop a hard place. Took hammer cock from Thor. Bro, please more. Four dark days later, and now you seem bored. <laughs> Doctor Stranger Things, you've got it twisted. <laughs> you got fisted. <laughs> I marvel at your ability to effortlessly spit shit lyrics thinking you're better than me. He wishes. Yeah. I give your mum click kisses. Ooh. Ketamine greasy hair, developing relevant evidence there. Elements of care. But there is one thing missing. Thinking you're rare, but when you speak, they don't listen. Time. I'm Hamby. Uh, I think that the battle was sick. They both come with some sick bars. Uh, Peach, he could have come harder. He forgot a few lines, and that's what let it down for me. Tommy came absolutely crazy. Some of the bars about Peach's teeth and his mum, and yeah, it was good. So I'm going to have to give this one to Tommy. Yo, my name is MBA. And um, yeah, the battle, was, the battle was dope. I liked it. I liked both of them. I feel like Peach in the first round, I actually liked his more than Tommy's in the first round. I liked all the teacher lines he was making about his plans, whatever, in the future. But then after that, after he was choking and that, like, he kind of dropped it. And Tommy was consistent all three rounds. Like, he, he brought it, like, all three rounds. So I'll give it to Tommy. But I like the battle. It was a dope battle. Yeah, what's going on? It's Levi Collins. Um, that was actually sick, right? But Peach's, right? You, you was relentless until you forgot. So it was going, it was going tit for tat all the way, like literally back forth, back forth. You two was playing tennis. It was, it was, it was confident. But 
I can't really speak about learning my own bars, but when it comes to battle rap, bro, if you carried on going harder, you could have possibly had that. But Tommy, you just went consistent with it and you schooled him. Sorry for the punch. Ladies and gentlemen, that was the first battle of the night. Can we make some noise? Yeah! Shout out to both battlers and thanks to Hubbly Bubbly. They both get a goodie bag today, so shout out to them. <laughs> However, the judges have deliberated and they have made the decision and their decision of that winner is Mr. Tommy Brown, let's make some noise! <laughs> shout out to both Bowler, shout out to Moonshine, shout out to Hubbly Bubbly.